So we'll start by following the administrator. Uh, this is an admin who works in an organization that makes a lot of use of Apache Kafka and they have a lot of developers in their organization who are creating Kafka topics, uh, producing events to Kafka topics, and they see that there's an opportunity here if those developers uh, had an easy way to share and reuse the Kafka topics that they create. So they're gonna install and set up an instance of event endpoint management. So we're gonna see how they go about doing that now. So starting in Cloudpack for integration, they're gonna go into their list of integration capabilities and click through to create a new capability. The one we're interested in here is event endpoint management. So they click on that and then click next. This is just a demo, so I don't need high availability. So for this, the administrator is gonna choose the one node template and then click next. There's not much to fill in here. They just need to give their instance a name. So I'm gonna call it Dale for now. And they need to accept the license. Now, quickly before I continue, um, I just want to show one thing in advanced settings. Now, if they wanted to manage REST APIs, GraphQL APIs alongside their Kafka topics, they could add support for that here by adding in APIs. But for this demo, I'm just going to be focusing on Kafka topics, so I'll leave it as events. And that's all they need to do. They can just click on create and the operator will start setting this up. And this will take a little while, so our administrator is probably going to go and get a coffee while they wait for the operator to set all of this up for them. Once it's ready, there are a few things that they might want to do to start preparing this instance of event endpoint management for their developers. For example, they might uh, configure it to use the email server that they have in their organization. But one of the first things they're going to want to do is to create an organization. And this organization represents the group of developers who are going to be using uh, this instance of event endpoint management. It might be a, a single team or a department, or it might be the entire company. But they'll give this organization a name, uh, make themselves the owner of it, and then click create. And that might be all an administrator needs to do. But for the purposes of this demo, let's assume that we've got a super helpful administrator who decides to create the first catalog for their developers and get it ready for them so they can start sharing Kafka topics straight away. So again, from the uh, Cloud Pack for integration, they click through to the instance that they've set up. So they're going to create a catalog and add the services that they know their developers will need. So from Manage Catalogs, they start by clicking on the Add button to add a new catalog. They need to give their catalog a name. And for this demo, I'm just gonna call it Demo. And then they need to uh, associate services uh, that will be used with this catalog. So there are two that they need. Um, firstly, they need an Event Gateway service. This is gonna be responsible for enforcing and managing access to the Kafka topics that are shared in this catalog. And they're going to need a developer portal. This is where application developers will be able to find and discover and in a self-service way get themselves access to the Kafka topics that they discover. So now that their catalog has uh, an event gateway service and a developer portal it's ready for their developers to start using.